Ladies and gentlemen, this is Keith from I Repair Autos. A couple weeks ago, I did a video showing you how to change out your AM FM uh, signal amplifier, and that video can be seen right around here. And I got some comments from folks saying, Hey, how do you know that you need to change this part? And there are a couple of things you could do you could use the uh, iCarsoft scanner or you could use the built-in diagnostics built right into your radio, that's correct. Your radio, and I've done a video on engineering mode as well, right here, you can see that video, as well as down in the description below, I have links to that, um, where you could put your radio into engineering mode. So let's get that going right away. I'm gonna show you how to look at your signal strength on your radio so that you can know whether or not your amplifier or your antennas of issue. Let's get started. What we're going to do is we're going to put the key in the ignition, put it so that the ignition is on but the engine hasn't started, and then we're going to hit the audio button. And what we're going to then do is we're going to hold down the OK seven and mute button. That'll put us into engineering mode and I'm gonna kill the light. Okay, so now that we're in engineering mode, we have a whole bunch of things and I have a video that goes through all of this. Once again, that's down in the description. But what we're concerned about is the signal strength of our tuner. So this tuner button right here, this tuner indication right here, we're gonna push tuner. And we have it on FM right now. And the frequency is relevant, really. But our signal strength is jumping around. Um, if I put that to a different station, I put it into 94.5. 94.5 is a very strong station out here in, in, in Massachusetts. And as a result, that signal strength has gone up. Now, your signal strength, based on where you are in the country... Um, will vary, but this is a very good, str uh, strong signal here that we're getting. Now I'm going to show you what that looks like with the amplifier disconnected. I'm going to run in into the back. I have the uh, panel off. I'm going to show you what that looks like. So looking at my signal strength right here, got the power. Right here, I could disconnect the power or I could disconnect the antenna itself. So I've disconnected the antenna. I'm gonna go back inside. And as you can see, with the antenna disconnected, it has dropped down to very low numbers. I, I just saw 55, 53, it's all over the place. And this is what it sounds like. It's a lot of static. All right. So that's how you tell. I'm gonna reconnect it the antenna that is, and we're gonna see how it jumps back up. So I'm gonna reconnect it. Let's go back and see how it looks. Okay, so it is now reconnected. Field strength is back up to 136, 137. Let's listen to what it sounds like. Okay, no static, clean signal. You know your tuner is getting the best possible signal for the antenna and the amplifier. So next week I'm gonna be doing an engine temperature sensor replacement. I know a lot of people have been asking for that, a lot of subscribers. So stay tuned for next week. I'm gonna be doing that next week. As always everyone, don't forget to like, share, subscribe to my channel if you find these videos helpful. Thanks and peace out.